Hey guys, thanks for watching today's video. If you want to see more from us, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel. So this is kind of cool. They do give you animal friendly sunscreen SPF 30. We got just a big tub of it, so that's nice to know. So here's the lockers. Lockers are also included. You just take a locker, remember your number, you grab the key and yeah, you get the idea. I can't really do this one handed, but <laughs> let's watch the professional do it. There we go. <laughs> Gotta get it open. Thank you. <laughs> and this is where you come to get your goggles or snorkels or so you guys will both need the wetsuits. Yeah, yeah wetsuits. So we need wetsuits for the diving sea adventure. So here's the sand dollar. So we found the map of everything you can do. So we're over here at the Grand Reef. This is where you're gonna do the sea adventure. That's a little helmet they put on you and shark swim so that's where you do the check-in you can get snorkeling gear there's different cabanas and grills so here's the dolphin lagoon broken up into three different areas you get assigned to which one you're going to be in if you're doing the dolphin swim and then over here they have like a lazy river and they have monkeys and otters and birds so lots going on over here guest services this is where we came in so we've already walked quite a bit but that's it, that's the map. So here is the Grand Reef area. This is where the diving happens. Okay, so because we are doing the diving activity, they gave us these wetsuits. So we picked up the wetsuits right next to where we got the locker and we gotta put that on and get acquainted with the temperature of the water I just felt it and it's a little bit chilly so they said put the wetsuit on first and go in slow get used to it that way when you get in you're comfortable being in a little bit of cold water the sun isn't out yet looks like it's gonna be an okay day at least in the morning might rain in the afternoon but the sun is not out so it's a little bit chilly as far as the water goes Make sure to follow our social media accounts where we'll be posting more content related to this YouTube channel. So here's the little cabanas. You can see these ones are already reserved because they have their names on them. And they have their own little mini fridges and show you really quick. Just get a peek in here. Look at all the fish and stingers. Pretty cool. I feel like she's like a doctor or something and she's checking them all out. Oh, okay. That woman, yeah, she probably knows all of them by name. <laughs> That's Stuart. Stuart? <laughs> so everything, I guess, opens at 9 a.m. So you can't really go in and do anything until 9 a.m. But once it is open, we can go swimming in here with the stingrays. And that's just included. You're allowed to swim in here with the stingrays if you come for the day. That's not an upcharge or extra. Oh, look at the shark. Oh, look, he's feeding them. He just fed the sharks. Oh, are they going? Oh, those aren't even the sharks, those are the fish. So this is the swimming with sharks area. And then across the bay, across the way, you can see they're getting the first round of people to go for this sea adventure, scuba diving helmet experience. That's how I describe it. Scuba diving with a helmet. Never done it before, but I'm excited. This was only like $40 extra, which is not bad. I was excited to try this and never done it before, so. 
this will be our first time. So we are doing this sea venture. That's going to be our first thing. They open the entire park at 9 a.m. as far as swimming or doing any of the activities. So we are going to be the first one on the first round to go for the sea venture at 9.15. We got our wetsuits. We put our stuff in the locker. All that was included. We've already had a very big breakfast. And we're gonna do this, and then we're gonna check out the dolphins. We have the dolphin swim at 10.50, and then we have lunch, and then we're gonna go over to the monkeys and the otters, swim with stingrays, so lots to do, lots of fun stuff coming up today. See, she's getting our helmets ready and prepared and aired up, guessed up. Oh cool, look, this is where we're gonna get to walk around down there with the thing on. It's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. With the big uh, stingrays. And the fish, some big stingrays in there. I'm excited, it looks cool. It's a big area too, actually. It's bigger than it looked from out there. It goes basically there and there's a rope. So that's where the division between the Sea Venture underwater diving helmet and then the just general area you can go swimming or walking in that has the stingrays, the smaller stingrays I saw in there. There's some bigger ones in here. But this whole area, we're going to get to walk around and enjoy. It's pretty cool. I'm excited. And then you have the sharks on the other side. Some big sharks in there. Those are nurse sharks. Those ones. And tiger shark. Some small ones and some really big ones. And then here's the beach. It's not open yet, but... Alright, so we have done our first big task of the day, no. other than breakfast <laughs> and getting here. And we put on our wetsuits. They're supposed to be a little snug. And they are, <laughs> so they're definitely a little tight, but the water is cold, we tested it. So we gotta get uh, used to the water first, get warmed up, and then we're gonna do the sea venture, the diving with the helmet, and then we're going to the dolphins, and then we're just gonna go explore Lazy River, see all the animals, and have a little fun, and have lunch. But yeah, I wanted to show you guys our very fashionable outfits here that we're gonna be using today. So 9 a.m., they open this little Cool swimming area. It's a little bit cold, so we're getting trying to get warm at least first before we do the diving. Yeah, it is really cold. <laughs> but in here, you can snorkel, and there are manta rays, stingrays, all that fun stuff. We're all checked in. Here's our safety briefing. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, we missed the safety briefing. If you want someone to stop, just do this. And the most important hand signal, if something's wrong, like ear or breathing problems. Anything like that, any phobias, claustrophobia. If we're scared of fish, this probably isn't the best experience for you guys, okay? <laughs> scared of Again, you'd be surprised. <laughs> But if you do have any of these things, it just means that we'd like to be aware of it. So just come up to one of us and just let us know. That way we can better help you guys in the water, okay? It doesn't mean that you can't participate if you do have those. Um, we also do not recommend if you are flying in the next four hours, if you are intoxicated or if you are pregnant, we highly advise against not doing this. But it seemed like everybody could walk straight around. We're next. See, we were the only smart ones. We were a little bit late. <laughs> we missed the beginning of the safety video, but uh, I know how to dive, so I'm not worried about it. But um, we got in the water and got used to the cold, so we'll be very well set, I hope, for this. Now there's where all the air comes from. They hook it up to that and each helmet. Interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 